Alright, what is up? This is Slow Playthroughs, and I'm here today for the 5K subscriber special video. This is going to be a very, very special video for the channel and for you guys. You know, this is an insane moment and just an insane milestone that we hit uh, about a couple of months ago. It was actually like a couple of months ago I hit this, but you know, I'm finally doing it now because it's been just really hectic and crazy this year with this end year. You know, we had Christmas, we have Thanksgiving and all this stuff going on so I think I hit this back in like November or actually October sometime in there like late October but uh, we made it we're here at 5,000 subscribers I honestly cannot believe we made it this far I know I say that in every single one of my you know milestone videos but it's the honest truth you know like just the growth the continuous support and everything on the channel has been insane for the past three years that I've been on YouTube and I know other channels probably grow faster, slower, whatever it is. This is where I am. This is my channel. This is our channel. You know, this is what we have accomplished through just making these videos and chilling out and having fun. And just, it's been a great time. I'm so thankful for it. And, you know, just, I want to say right now, thank you all so, so fucking much from the bottom of my heart for everything, <laughs> for everything, the continued support, the comments that you guys give me, the tweets that I receive. You know, everything is great. I get those comments from time to time that are just so long, heartwarming, and just amazing, and they really make me feel like I'm doing something right with my life, you know? And YouTube has become just a, such a big part of my life that, you know, I, I definitely want to share this experience with you guys. And, you know, for many years to come, we'll go through here and we'll just continue making these awesome videos and having a great time. So thank you all so much for this. It is awesome. I, I'm still like mind blown from a couple of months ago whenever I hit this milestone. And to be honest, we're almost at 6K subscribers. We're closing in on it, like a little bit, of, a little bit over 100 subscribers until 6K. So what the fuck, guys? You guys are insane. And oh my God, my freaking Wii U is going off right there. But yeah, this is going to be the room kind of more of a setup tour. Um, I was gonna, I was planning on doing a complete room tour, but my room looks like absolute shit, and it would take me forever to clean it, and I kind of just want to, you know, renovate it later on, and save it for another time, another milestone, I don't know exactly when, but I'll definitely be doing a room tour sometime in the near future, hopefully, but for now, we got just the setup tour going on here, and uh, not only that, there are two parts to this subscriber special, that it's, it's all going to be in just this jam-packed, awesome end of the year video. Uh, this is actually a uh, giveaway as well. So we're going to be doing a $50, no, $50 or $60. I think I was going to do $60. Yeah, I was going to do a $60 uh, Nintendo eShop gift card kind of giveaway for you guys. Um, what that entails is that I do give away $50 and a $10 in, you know, just one thing because, you know, $60 are, it's how much I think one game is. But it's all dependent on what game you guys are buying, and I'll definitely have a discussion with the winner uh, of what they want. And I'll be happy to give you guys maybe like a Steam gift card, a PSN card, or whatever, uh, Xbox, whatever platform that you guys use. It doesn't have to be straight up Nintendo, but I'm focusing on Nintendo because that's what my channel's about. It's all about just Nintendo content, and you know, I feel like that's the reason why I'm here at 5K subscribers. So why not give back to my main audience that, you know, enjoys Nintendo games just like I do so uh, that's what I feel like would be the best thing to do and I'll be doing one winner $60 gift card or if it's less than that I might choose two winners I don't know exactly just yet um, I'm still you know kind of thinking about what I want to do for it but that is kind of the official you know giveaway that I, I had planned so in order to enter this giveaway guys it's really simple and I just keep hitting my fucking tripod <laughs> it's really simple all you have to do is like this video uh, this is for subscribers only, so for the people that have helped me out this whole time, this is for you guys, and, you know, obviously just sub to the channel. Um, comment down below, and yeah, that's basically all I think would be the easiest thing. I mean, just to comment down below, uh, I was going to say do like the hashtag slow5k or some shit like that, but I mean, I know no one's going to do that. <laughs> some people aren't going to do that, I'm going to include them anyways, because I'm going to be using a, like some separate website in order to pick the giveaway winner. It's randomized, you know, as usual, just a standard good shit. So uh, I'm actually gonna hit this right here so that we can, yeah, I want it, I want it bright. So <laughs> yeah, guys, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do this quick kind of setup tour and 
this isn't only just to show off like what I have going on here and how I make my videos it's more of to show you guys you know that it's you don't need a lot of crazy equipment in order to record and become a youtuber and that's what we're gonna get into right now enough of my talking I am already like five minutes into this fucking video and I have just been straight up talking this whole time so uh, I don't want my finger on the microphone crap okay so uh, here we go I'm sitting in my chair right here which is just a standard chair you guys don't really need to see that it's nothing too crazy it's not a DX racer or anything but right here we got the nice and clean blue Yeti this is what I've been using for my videos for the past almost two years or over a little over two years I got this back in like I think 2013 so almost three years now <laughs> crazy stuff but uh, actually, no, did I get in 2014? I don't know, whatever. But I've had it for a, a good two years, and this is the black edition. Like, it's not the black out, it's just the black one. You know, it's got the nice and clean, you know, black color. Uh, we got the mute button right there, volume. Got a standard pop filter, nothing too crazy. You know, I just put it like that, and then I talk in the video. And this shit smells awful. Do not, do not ever get too close to this because... It smells just horrible like pot filters do not smell good at all just to tell you guys any of you guys that make YouTube videos you guys probably already know it smells like absolute shit so we have the USB going down in there we have my monitor which is pretty basic there's nothing crazy about it I I think it's a really shitty monitor but you know it gets the job done it's like 1440 by like 900 I think it's something real stupid it's not HD at all it takes the like DVI cable that's down there or something like that but this is my monitor we got my YouTube channel going on here and yeah you know get <laughs> still have the banner for happy holidays that you know I just like to have that there and uh, look at that look at this we are currently at 5,890 subscribers 833,000 views total views what the hell you guys are crazy man like I can't believe it I just honestly cannot believe how far we've gotten on this point and it's also New Year's Eve so yeah happy New Year's to you guys you know that's awesome that we're already at the end of the year and that, that's why I kind of wanted to do this video today so that you know I could have this and look back at it on 2015 uh, like later in my life be like oh yeah this is 2015 this is where I was at you know this is what I used to record this is what I was doing if I'm still doing this and like in later years I have no idea but here we go we have the Logitech C920 I think that's what it's called uh, webcam I don't use it at all but hey you know comment down below if you guys want to see webcam series I don't know dude if you guys like that kind of shit I mean I'll be glad to, I'll be happy to do it but uh, currently I'm just not really feeling webcam I, I, there's no purpose in doing it right now because it's just like standard videos and stuff but uh, I got the little Christmas tree going on there you know me I'm festive I like Christmas uh, we got my horrible speakers there's actually another one back over there which these are disgusting I mean they have like shit all over them I don't know these are like from my mom's like old old job I think from probably like 10 years ago or something like that she just brought them to me and uh, if I'm gonna upgrade anything with my setup it's gonna be these these right here they're horrible uh, they have this weird noise when I turn them on I don't know if you can even hear that but it's just an awful noise whenever you turn it on. It's like bzzz, a kind of buzzing noise. Uh, they're not bad speakers. It's just that little noise right there is kind of annoying. And they're outdated. I think if I'm going to upgrade anything, it'll definitely definitely be those. Um, we have my TV right here, which is a Dynex. I don't know if you guys can see that. And oh my god, it's getting all crazy right there. But um, yeah, it's Dynex. I mean, there's nothing too crazy about that. Nothing too insane. It's just a normal 1080p. Uh, TV, I, I think it's 1080p. I honestly don't know. Uh, we got the Wii sensor bar, Wii U sensor bar, whatever, uh, up there for like whenever I'm playing Skyward Sword or any other games that are Wii related because obviously I do play them on my Wii U, which this is the Wii U that I did an unboxing on back in 2013. I know that for a fact because this is whenever I got it. Um, this is the Wind Waker HD edition or something i have no idea uh what the fuck why is that game in there i'm just joking splatoon's not a bad game okay i know i give it a lot of shit but it's not a horrible it's not a really bad game it's just i don't really care for those first person shooter games or just shooter games in general but yeah that is the wii u right there i just have it chilling on top of this um on like the gamepad chilling on top of the wii u uh just a word of advice do not do what i'm doing right now it scratches this shit up like crazy because the wii u is extremely fragile 
I don't know why it is, but it is horrible. It's like, it gets scratched so easily, and I didn't notice that until I packed this up and I was checking something on it, and it just like got all screwed up on there. So don't do that. Put it on the stand, which I have right there. I don't know why I'm not using it. I'm, I'm just an idiot sometimes with this kind of stuff. But we have my keyboard over here that I just completely skipped. I have no idea why. Uh, it looks gross. I don't know. It's, it's, a, it's just like a Dell keyboard. It's nothing, once again, nothing special. It's just your standard keyboard that came with my monitor. I even had a mouse with it that I was using for a while, but I ended up having to upgrade it because it had this double click problem, which I'll show you guys in a minute. But uh, there's the remote, and you know, it's a good keyboard. It's a good keyboard. I mean, it, it's fine, it clicks pretty well. I mean, it's not mechanical, or I don't think it is. Uh, it's just your, st your standard keyboard. I don't really need anything crazy because I don't really play a lot of PC games, and I mean, even then, it's just like, Hey, it's a good keyboard. It does it gets the job done just like the monitor. I like it. Um, right here we got some earphones, Apple earphones. You know, I feel like those are the best. They're really comfortable. I like them. Uh, I've been using them for probably my whole life ever since I started just using earphones. I think I use these the most. And uh, right here is my 3DS capture card. Uh, it's in its little Animal Crossing case that I got from I think Club Nintendo or something like that. I think this is my final gift that I got something like that and I'm gonna go ahead and just slide it out here it's this beautiful blue color and it's it's great it's a great capture card I have cats or kitties um, gets the job done records videos pretty nicely uh, let's go and open it up right here and there we go that's it very nice standard capture card uh, to prove that it is the cats or kitty one we have the USB oh fuck focus See, that's the problem I gotta like manually focus this it's got the USB right there and there it is, that's it. Pretty much all that goes for the 3DS capture card. And over here is the USB kind of thing. I don't know, I don't really know. Just USB cord that I use to, for the capture card. That's what I plug in. And over here we got, all right, so the video just decided to stop recording. That's what happens with these DSLR cam cameras. They just like stop recording for no fucking reason. So I do apologize for that minor cut, but yeah, we have the Warrington, Oregon, uh, mouse pad. I, I'm gonna be honest. I have no idea where this came from. It's just one day I needed a mouse pad, and I was like, "Mom, do you got one?" And she just like threw this at me, and I was like, "All right, cool." And then I've just been using it ever since. Uh, I have no family members from there. I have, I don't live there. I was never from there. I don't know why I have this, where this one came from, but that's what I use. It's just a mouse pad. It gets the job done. Once again, like I said, this setup, it's nothing crazy, but it, it just gets the job done. And it's pretty good. Um, right here, we got the Logitech G502S. I think that's what it's called. Uh, this is a gaming mouse, a fantastic mouse. Okay. I don't really, like I said, I don't really game too much, but if I'm going to use a mouse of choice, I'd say I'd recommend this one. It's great. Um, I did have a Dell one, like I said, that matched this keyboard and this monitor because this all came in one set on my old 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 pc this was like the family pc that we used but this is the mouse that i've been using for the past couple of months after my old one broke because it had this double click problem and it is fantastic um you know i can do everything with it we got the right click we got the normal click we got the dpi thingy or whatever the fuck it's called where you can increase it and make it really fast on here as you can see whoa shit <laughs> and you can like increase the speed to your liking or whatever. It's a great mouse and I really do recommend it. I mean, it looks like a fucking robot. It's crazy. I, I never used a mouse like this in my life and a gaming mouse is definitely a cool step up from an old garbage Dell mouse that I've been using. And uh, I mean, it wasn't bad. It actually lasted a good seven years or something like that. But right here we have my bamboo uh, tablet, drawing tablet or whatever. Uh, I think it's called like a Wacom or Wacom, Wacom, whatever the fuck, how to, I don't even know how to pronounce that shit, but uh, I've been using this ever since last year when I got it on Black Friday for like 50 bucks, really good deal, uh, probably the most basic, most used tablet, drawing tablet, everybody and their mom has this one if you're going to use a drawing tablet because it's actually pretty good, I mean, I like it a lot, there's a USB that comes with it, the pen is over here, if I can actually get it, oh shit, let me move it over here, there we go. We got the pen over there, uh, great tablet, once again, highly recommended, uh, it's pretty good, I've been, I don't really draw too much, the, drawing is one of those things where it's like, I gotta be feeling, feeling like I'm drawing, like I wanna, 
I gotta feel it. I gotta be like ready to draw and you know wanting to do it. So uh, if I'm gonna draw, I'll use this drawing tablet. I'll just go on Photoshop. You know, maybe do a little bit of sketches and stuff. It's fun. It's it, it's drawing is a really fun hobby to do, and you know I love drawing. I love art. So this is definitely something that I've been using for uh, the past year, and it's pretty good. I like it a lot. So now we're moving on to the final piece of resistance. Yes, motherfucker, this is it. <laughs> so I gotta go ahead and crouch down here. Uh, disregard what, what you just saw over there. It's just some bunch of clothes because I don't like to have my clothes in the drawers because they make my clothes smell awful. But yeah, uh, we have the Elgato Game Capture HD. There we go. Uh, I don't have the HD60 or the HD60 Pro because I got this one uh, once again like two or three years ago whenever I started, you know, upgrading my shit for YouTube and started recording more. And I've been using this ever since. Great capture card, fantastic. Probably my favorite capture card out of all of them. I used to have a Roxio game capture that was garbage. Don't ever use that shit. It's awful. Um, I really don't like the Roxio. Um, I don't know if the Roxio game capture HD is better, but I had the original and it was really bad. But it is a fucking mess down here. I do apologize. You know, I this is the best I could do. Uh, this setup looks nothing like this usually. It looks much worse, <laughs> just to tell you. So we got the PS4 down here with the controller, and man, it's super grainy down here. I wish I could fix that, but yeah. Um, we got the PS4, recently just got this, love it. Been playing a lot of Uncharted recently. Um, it's great, great, great console. Definitely recommend it if you're gonna get one of the new next gen uh, out of the PS4 or the uh, Xbox One. I say the PS4 is the best because, you know, PS4 is great. I love Sony products and, you know, I don't really play a lot of Sony's like video games and all like their series, but I've gotten into the Uncharted series and I love it so far. It's a great console and yeah, I've been playing that uh, a lot recently. So we also got my little hard drive here. I think this is a two terabyte or one terabyte, one of those uh, external hard drive that I use to, I think it's a Seagate one that I put all my shit on, uh, extra stuff that I need to put on there. And I can't even see if I'm focusing that correctly. Yeah, we got that going on and that's just for extra storage. Right here we have a couple of GameCube controllers. Um, we have this standard purple one, I have a couple a uh, silver and a black one uh, at the back of my room where I have my old ass CRT TV where I play Melee and Project Demo with my brother. Uh, I just keep that back there and like I said, I'll, I'll save that for another time whenever I do uh, a complete room tour and we can check that out. We got the Wii U, um, what is it, GameCube adapter, whatever it's called, uh, great adapter. Uh, sometimes I'll use it for PC. To play like Melee on, but you know, it's just, uh Melee's not good on PC. Just playing on normal freaking TV on the console and all that stuff. Um, and then we got the uh, Wii uh, controller. I don't even know. I'm going blank right now. What the hell? We got the controller. <laughs> uh, we have the Nunchuck. And it is the Zelda 25th Anniversary Edition or whatever for that came with Skyward Sword whenever I got it. Uh, pretty good. It got fucked up, as you can see, like right here. You see that shit? Yeah, I got all fucked up because batteries fucking exploded and it just melted the freaking uh, paint off of it, the gold paint, because it was supposed to be gold. It was initially gold and it just destroyed it. Always take out your batteries <laughs> whenever you're using uh, just controllers that take batteries. Always take them out when you're done because if you don't, they're probably going to bust open and fuck up your shit. But uh, I know right here it just looks kind of funny because it's like all nice and neat. Like I said, it normally does not look like this. This controller is like back over there under this. This controller is like flying somewhere over there on the wall. And this controller might as well be up my ass because I don't know where this shit comes from. Like seriously, it's, stuff is everywhere in my room. I decided to just clean it up and you know this video is a big excuse to tell me, tell my ass to clean this stuff up. So hey, at least I cleaned up <laughs> for this video. Uh, we got my shoes and like some dumbbells over there, which I don't even fucking use. I thought one time, oh yeah, I'm gonna work out, but yeah, it didn't work. They're like three pounds anyway, so like, <laughs> my ass is dumb. I don't know what I'm doing. But here we go, right here we have my PC. Uh, pretty good PC, I just upgraded it recently. Got the i5 processor, got a 250, I think it's an R9 250X graphics card. Uh, I think it's only like one gigabyte, nothing too special. Uh, pretty standard, pretty good. Uh, the webcam is plugged up in there. This thing is a freaking lifesaver. I use this to uh, put in SD cards and just whatever I need. If I need to put an SD card and you know put my videos on here, that's probably what I'm gonna use to put the video on. Uh, on the side here, we got my motherboard. I have no idea what the motherboard is. I'll put all the specs in the description, but it lights up red. It's cool. And uh, I also have this lighting. Oh shit! I have it lighting up blue. Uh, 
I mean, this is my brother's old case. I never, I don't really care for lights that much, but they were already installed in there and I can't turn them off. So, uh, pretty cool. I mean, we got the red, white, and blue. I mean, it's like America, motherfucker, or like South Korea. I don't know. I mean, I am Korean, so might as well. But yeah, the guys, uh, that's my PC. Pretty good PC, gets the job done, does a great job with rendering, and you know, if I'm gonna upgrade anything, it'll probably be the graphics card in the near future. But yeah, that's basically my entire gaming setup. Not really a gaming setup because, it, I mean, I can really call it that. It's pretty, pretty basic, but uh, it does, it definitely does get the job done and does a great job of doing it. And yeah, that is my entire YouTube recording setup. Once again, thank you all so much for 5,000 subscribers. Once, oh my god, I can't, I can't even think straight right now. It's just crazy to think that we made it this far. We're almost at 6K by the end of this year. And, you know, it's a crazy concept. Thank you all so much. And I just want to say shout outs to a couple of awesome friends and people that have helped me get this far. Uh, Phoenix Master One, my boy Pietro. Uh, he's helped me since the beginning, ever since I started my old YouTube channel, Slow Playthroughs, back in 2011. Uh, joining Legendary Gamers HD, he's just been a huge ass help. And I freaking love this guy, he's awesome. Go check out his channel, I'll put his channel in the description. Uh, another person, The Battle Productions, Michael, dude, you're awesome. Thanks for everything, all your support on videos and stuff, and just being a great friend. You're awesome, dude. Check his channel out. Uh, Mega Man NG, Jose, shout out to you, dude. You're awesome, you help me out a lot too. You know, you're a great, great friend, and you know, same thing with everybody else. You know, they're just really good friends, and I'm, I know I don't really talk to you guys on a normal, normal, like regular basis, but when we do, it's awesome to have like great conversations with you, <clears throat> and you know, it's awesome. You know, good stuff. Um, shout out to two more people that I met actually earlier this year, uh, Blue Kokiri and 88 Yoshi Rocks. You guys make some great content. You have such great potential. I think you guys can make it big on YouTube as well. Just work hard at it, and you will definitely get there. And you know, go ahead and check out their channels too. Uh, who else am I missing? Frankie Games, my boy Frankie. Check out his channel as well. He's awesome. He makes some funny content. He's just a funny dude. And you know, all those Skype calls that were <clears throat> we go in and I, you know, I talk with them and all that stuff. They're great people. So check all of them out in the description below. And other people, I'll include some other people that have helped just support the channel so much. Like almost all of my videos, you know, every time I upload a video, I always get a notification that they liked it. So thank you guys so much for everything. We have made it. It's the end of 2015. New Year's is tomorrow. We're entering a new year, 2016. New resolutions, new goals, hopefully a new future and just positivity flourishing everywhere. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't say it enough because I just keep fucking saying it. I don't know why, but it's just, it's just great, man. It's a crazy concept. We're here, we've made it. So once again, if you wanna enter the giveaway, go ahead and comment down below, Subcri subscribe to the YouTube channel, like the video, and you will be automatically entered into this giveaway, and I'll do this giveaway, uh, I'll, I'll say like a week from now, so on like the 7th, like January 7th of the new year of 2016, that's crazy. So yeah, this will take a full year <laughs> in order to get this game out, this freaking giveaway, but uh, once again, yeah, you guys can comment down below, <clears throat> and you know, just, Tell me what you guys thought about this video, uh, what your setup is like. Um, you know, I don't even think people do video responses anymore, but whatever. <laughs> if you want to, go ahead and that's going to do it. Thank you all so much. I'll see you guys in the new year. Here's to another 5K. I love you guys so much. Thanks again. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Take care.